pray for you. I saw, I don't know, I saw something like Sevilla. Yes, but of huh? God. Yes, but of God. I'm seeing Sevilla. Number two, I'm seeing someone that was born in 19... 1979. That's me, man of huh? God. That's me. 1979. Yes, man of God. And I'm since November. Yes, that's my birthday month. It's your birth month. Yes. Listen, there's a spirit of limitation. Yes, man because of God. Because according to me, you're supposed to be traveling a lot. True, man of God. And I'm seeing businesses. True, man of God. And from here, I'm seeing doors that the enemy has closed for so long opening today. Oh. So what are you doing in this man? Huh? You are doing what? You are blocking everything. Who are you? Huh? Why do you want to know? Who are you? Why do you want to know? So why are you blocking him? Because I don't want him to be successful. Huh? I don't want him to be successful. You don't want him to do what? To be successful. To be successful? Yes. So why are you blocking all these connections that I'm seeing? I just want to block everything that has to do with this boy. You just want to block everything? Everything. But you've got a name. Who are you? No. Huh? No, can't tell. You can't tell? No. Nope. You don't want to tell me who are you? No. I touch your stomach. I burn your stomach. You demon. And take out this food that you've been giving him in the night. Come on! <coughs> in Jesus' mighty name. You're free. You're free. And can you tell us the prophecy you received today and also confirm it? Yes, the prophecy was true because the man of God has located me with my surname. He started his hearing of the name Sibia. Then furthermore, he located me with my, my age of birth, the day I was born. So he went furthermore, he prophesied about my life being like on stagnancy, that he saw me like some, supposed to be traveling, and he's, the devil is losing my connections, of which is true. Because by profession, I'm a sales engineer, and previously I used to travel a lot, I even went to the US, but since then things they just went down. So coming to an issue of connection, on Wednesday I phoned one of my customers, just like to check on the business side, then he came back and said they wanted us to do something together, which is like opening a company. So it is true. Suppose you have a lot of connection, but now there's nothing happening. And the fact that you know that we were supposed to have a lot of con uh, connections and they were not coming, how was it affecting you? Actually, it was very affecting me big time because like financially everything just went down because I believe that's what I was supposed to get more of my breakthroughs. But because of the devil knew exactly where to cash me. So you hold that part. So nothing is happening at the moment. Yeah. And for how long has this been taking place? Actually, it's been for some years now. I can say plus minus three years because I even like registered my own company in 2016. But there's nothing moving seriously. Because like when I check all the guys that I've helped, some of them now they're making a lot of money or supposed to do something great, but my side there's nothing happening. Yes. 
And were you praying for God's intervention concerning this challenge? Actually, when the man of God, before he could even start with the prophecy, I prayed to God that, please, Lord, let it be, today be my day. Please let him locate me and so that I can get my deliverance. Yes. And how are you feeling now that you have received indeed your deliverance today and a word of change upon your life? Actually, I'm happy because I can say this deliverance came at the right time because now in July I'm expecting a huge contract. So I believe after this deliverance it will come to pass. And what is it that you believe God will do upon your life? I believe God will open more doors for me. My life will come back to be where it's supposed to be. Whatever that I was destined for, I think now it will come to pass.